Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about program to display pyramid pattern using a star. Next, I'm going to discuss about the way of execution of this program. So, if you uh, debug the code, then control comes to main function. Here, after control comes to this point. And here, I have taken uh, three integer type variable int, i, j, and k. So, i start from 5 and check the condition 5 greater than 1. That's true. Come inside and here j start from 5 also check the condition 5 greater than 5 so that condition is not true come to this point and here k start from 1 check the condition 1 less than equal to 5 so that's true so and here that print is start now or that go up and increase the value of k. So k become 2. And here check the condition 2 less than equal to i value 5. Condition true. Again that print a star. Here after or uh, again increase the value of k. So k become 2 to 3. Check the condition 3 less than equal to 5. That's true. Print again a star. Again, that increase the value of k. So k become 4. Check the condition for less than equal to 5. That's true. Again, that print is star. Again, k increase by 1. So k become 4 to 5. Check the condition 5 less than equal to 5. That's true. Again, print is star. Now, again, increase the value of k. So k become 5 to 6. Check the condition 6 or less than. Oh, fine. So condition not true. Control comes to this point. So cursor blink at the new line. Here after again go back and in or decrease the value of i. So i become 5 to 4. Now check the condition. 4 greater than equal to 1. That's true. Come inside. J value start from 5 again. 5 or greater than i value 4. That's true. Come inside, add here, print blank space. So add here, this will print blank space. Now again, that uh, go up and decrease the value of j. So j become 5 to 4. Check the condition, 4 greater than i. So that's not true. Control comes to this point. k start from 1 again. Check the condition, 1 or uh, less than equal to i, i value 4. So that's true. Come inside. So right here, that print and star. Go up, increase the value of k. So k become 2. Check the condition 2 less than equal to i. Uh, that's true. Come inside, print a star. So right here, increase the value of k. k become 3. 3 less than equal to i. i value 4. So that's true. Print a star again. K increase uh, by 1 so k become 4 check the condition for less than equal to uh, 4 that's true print star again now k uh, become uh, 4 to 5 check the condition 5 less than equal to 4 that's not true control comes to this point right here or uh, cursor blink to new line here uh, 
uh, go and decrease the value of i so i become 3 check uh, 3 greater than equal to 1 that's true now control comes to this point j start from 5 again check the condition 5 greater than 3 that's true or uh, that print uh, blank space here after that go up and decrease the value of j so j become 4 or uh, check again 4 greater than 3 that's true again blank space uh, and now uh, j become 4 to 3 uh, so at here 3 uh, greater than 3 that's not true so control comes to this point okay uh, start from 1 again and uh, check the condition 1 greater less than equal to 3 that's true so right here print a star again k gonna increase by 1 k2 and add here 2 less than equal to 3 that's true print a star and uh, k become uh, 3 so 3 check the condition 3 less than equal to 3 print a star again and now uh, from uh, here that out to oh sorry again oh that increase the value of k so k become 4 check the condition 4 less than equal to oh, 3 that's not true so control comes to this point so I right have cursor blink at new uh, line now i gonna decrease by 2 check the condition 2 greater than equal to y that's true j start from 5 again or oh, check oh, 5 greater than 2 that's true oh, print blank space Again, j decrease by 1, so j become 4. So, right here, uh, j value of 4 greater than 2, that's true. Blank space again print. Right here, j uh, decrease by 1, 3 become and uh, 3 greater than uh, 2, that's true. Blank space. Uh, now, j become 2. Uh, check the condition 2 greater than 2, that's not true. So add here or uh, that out from uh, this part. Add here k start from one again. Check the condition one or uh, less than equal to or uh, two. That's true. That go inside and print star. Again or uh, k increase by one. So k become two. Two greater than. Check the condition two greater than equal to two. That's two. Print star again. Now uh, k become or uh, three. Check the condition 3 less than equal to 2, that's uh, not true. So cursor blink at new line. And now uh, I value decrease by 1, so I become 1. Check the condition 1 less than equal to 1, that's uh, true. Go inside J, you know, 5 again. And check the condition 5 greater than equal to 1, so that's true. Uh, blank is Swiss print. Again, J decrease by 1, J become 4. Check the condition 4 greater than i value 1 that's true blank is very straight again j decrease by 1 so j become 3 check the condition 3 greater than 1 oh that's true blank space again and again j decrease by 1 so j become 2 add here check the condition 2 greater than or 1 that's true blank space and add here oh, again j decrease by 1 so j become 1 or oh, 1 less than 1 that's not true. Control comes to this point. K start from 1 again. Add here 1 less than equal to 1. That's true. Print a star. And now again K increase by 1. So K become 2. Check the condition 2 less than equal to uh, I value 1. So that's not true. Control comes to this point. Add here cursor blink at new line. Now J become uh, 0. So add here. Uh, j decrease by 1, so j becomes 0. Check the condition 0 greater than uh, equal to 0. Uh, 0 greater than equal to 1, so that's not true. So that out from upper for loop and now that out from uh, main uh, function. So final output we have this. So this is the way of execution of this program. So I hope guys you understand. So thanks for watching. See you next time.